I'm here today with Deirdre Dyson to look at her latest collection, All at Sea, which really emulates the movement of water and the ever-changing facade of the ocean itself. Deirdre, how did this collection start? At that period, I was stuck on my boat um, for about three months. I didn't have any other inspiration around me except the sea. And fortunately, um, in the past, I'd taken lots of wonderful photographs of the changing colours on the sea and the light on the sea. And so I thought I will just see what I can create that will turn into a carpet. So you start each collection with drawings and sketches and, and paintings. I make the, my drawing accurate. I send it to my computer designer. And once we have the accurate rendition on the computer, we can make any change that we like for the client in terms of colour, size, features, anything. So looking at sunlit, um, the ripple effect that you've created really does showcase, you know, the movement of water itself and the depth of, you know, the water. How have you emulated that? This is the sun pattern on moving water that I managed to capture. And it's so beautiful and so natural. It, it, it's a design in itself. I didn't really have to do much to it. I had to choose a colour, a solid colour, but then another colour that was less a mixture of the sea and the sun, so that you feel as if you're looking through that piece of sunlight. When looking at pieces such as Golden Glints, how did you know which parts to focus on and how did you make that decision? The cliffs themselves are gold, apricot, mm. green, so many colours. And I took sheets of photographs of red sea, green sea, yellow sea, gold sea. Um, and I just chose a one particular area that looked as if it had gold glittering on the surface. And I've done those areas in silk on the carpet. I'd love to also touch on the art of hand knotting and the, the communities that you work with in Nepal. Every stitch is hand woven with a knot, which is particular to Nepal. Um, there are about 100 stitches to the size of a postage stamp. Wow. Um, and this is why my normal size carpets take three months to make. In current times where people want to feel connected to nature, I think it's amazing how you can bring it in to the home through these works of art themselves. I was worried all the time that it wouldn't work as a carpet. Why would anyone want the sea on their floor? But I just thought, I'm going to do it anyway. Yeah. yeah.